This is a truly historic day in my forest, and I brought out my chainsaw for a reason. Here, beside the trail, on the western edge of the forest, is a brand new baby Miracle Sisters chestnut tree, and it was not planted by me. This means that thanks to my care, the Miracle Sisters chestnut tree is producing enough nuts that the squirrels can't keep track of the ones that they bury, and this one survived. I'm now going to cut down this very large tree to open up the canopy overhead and provide more sunlight for this baby. Because even though it's beside the trail, the forest is quite dense here and there's very little sunlight getting down to the forest floor. So first I have to make sure that I've got my angle exactly right so that the tree will fall precisely in the area where it is intended. And once I've got that cut established, it's time to make a speedy exit. Because you never know what's going to happen when a really big tree falls in the forest. Now that it's safe, I can put the chainsaw down and spend a moment with the baby tree and I came to a conclusion that it's time to open up the other side of the trail a little bit where the trees aren't so big but they are quite dense not just to provide the little baby on the other side of the trail with more light but also to make room for another chestnut tree to be a companion to it but I'm not going to wait for nature I'm going to plant one of this year's crop. And note that this one is only a few months old. And it's already larger than the one that I just discovered. Even though that tree is already a year old. The reason why is quite self-evident. It's been attacked by the deer all last year and throughout the winter, it was chewed on. It's amazing that it was able to survive at all, but thankfully it did, as evidenced by this nice lush set of growth right at the top. So now, with my deer protection in place, hopefully this tree will grow quickly and tall especially with its companion on the other side of the trail. With this incredible finding, it's now clear that this forest is well on its way to the day when chestnut trees will be popping up all throughout the forest and beyond. <laughs>